how to wear your cap and gown. The first thing you need to do is to make sure your gown is the right size. The size is chosen by your height. There are no male or female gowns. There is just one gown for everybody. The gown should stay zipped at all times. The sleeves should fall between your elbow and the palm of your hand. The bottom of the gown should fall below the knee and above your ankles. If you think there is something wrong with your gown, please contact the Commencement Welcome Center right away. Do not wash or dry clean your gown as it will ruin the fabric. To differentiate female versus male regalia, female graduates wear a white collar attached to the gown with velcro or safety pins. To know which side of your cap faces forward, refer by the seam. It should always be on the back of your head. The cap should be flat and level to the floor with the crown about an inch above your eyebrows. The tassel is moved to the left side only after you have graduated and the provost will give you a clue when to do this. Robbing areas will be organized on commencement day prior to the ceremony in Scap to One lobby where you can go for finishing touches like safety pins, bobby pins, sunscreen and other. Well, that's it now. Come commencement day you can look your best for the crowd as well as your photos. Congratulations!